everyone. I hope you all can hear me. I hope the stream sounds alright as well. Is it double pull in one temple? Trust. I don't think that's gonna happen. Hi Greenster. Hi Hanny. Hi Felix. Hi Vex. Hi everyone who's come to the stream today to watch the red one pulls. Um, if anyone has a good uh, suggestion for where I should do the pulls, please let me know. Otherwise, I'm probably gonna pull here next to the Arataki Drumalong <laughs> Festival where Ito has just been arrested. Um, right now on the team I have Sara, Goro, Sayu, and of course the man of the hour, Arataki Ito. Um, I put Sayu in there, but I'm thinking if I get Kuki, I'll put her in there instead of him. Also, is the music a little bit loud, or is it just me? I'm gonna change- I'm gonna turn the volume down just a- just a touch. Also gonna bring my mic closer. Alright. What? Mommy? Mommy? Mommy madame? Mommy madame? Also our Tengu queen? The banner is coming out in one minute. I believe there is no banner right now. Yeah, there's no banner right now. It's kind of weird to see, isn't it? Like, you literally just got the standard banner there. <laughs> Hanny, Hanny said mommy! I don't know what else to say. Hi, Rudy. Rudy has redeemed Moo, so I have to move for y'all. Um, <clears throat> I hope I'm a convincing cow. Or, you know what's really a convincing cow? This. Look at him. Look at this funky little guy. Oh, there he goes. Alright, it's time guys. It's time, 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 it's time. And also, anyone who's rolling for the weapon, remember to do this first. Do not pick the wrong one. Do not forget to set your path. Make sure that this weapon here is the one that you want. Don't regret it later, please. Please. Her model indeed gives off mommy vibes. It's getting better. Ushi best cow? Yes, Ushi is the best cow. I have 489 fates. That is almost twice the amount that I would need to actually guarantee the weapon. So I'm not scared of not getting the weapon. I'm more scared of not getting it until I have pulled three five stars. So, um, anyway, I guess, um, without further ado, let's go. I've surrounded myself with all of Ito's lucky items. His Genius Invocation TCG Limited Edition gift box, Kitsune Ramen All You Can Eat, um, an Onikabuto gift box, which I bet the beetle inside is dead, a stolen bulletin board, and a very nice picture of Miss Hina. Don't they look just a little bit alike? Don't, there's like this there's like a weird resemblance between these two. Whale? Yes, I am whale. How did you know? No, I'm joking, I'm 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 not whale. Alright, 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 let's go. Some 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 thumb sounds of good luck, I don't know. Um where did my wish screen go? That's not the wish screen. Okay, let's go. First 10, let's go. This is nerve wracking. Okay, that's definitely not Red Horn. That's my 11th Lion's Roar. Great. I should probably go over the four star weapons here and mention that. The only other weapon banner I've rolled on is the first Engulfing Lightning banner, which came alongside the Unforged, so I have multiple of the weapons from the series now, actually. Um, the other four weapons, I maybe have refinement two of at max. I have zero lithic blades because it's a weapon banner limited item, but the Lion's Roar was on the last banner I rolled on, so I already have ten of it. So, of all the weapons that I could get, I want that one the least. The rest of them are all pretty decent, though, so I'm hoping to get at least one copy of each of them. Lion do be roaring loud with 11 of them. My ka -ching is all powerful. Okay, this is 20. Razor? Okay, I already have his uh, C6, so this is just a bonus. Nice, set frags. Very nice. 
a buff for my sucrose later. Alright, let's go. Another one. 30. Let's go. Okay, I guess I'm not getting any early pities with this roll, unfortunately. Um, I'm hoping to at least get one before 60 rolls, but I don't think that's gonna happen, knowing my luck. Yep, this is 40 already. What did I even get? I totally- I skipped past it by accident, oh my god. Well, I definitely didn't get a 5 star there, so I guess it didn't matter. Did you make your model yourself or was it commissioned? I made it myself. I have a few stream VODs up on my YouTube channel and on my Twitch channel right now since they haven't been deleted of me creating this model from scratch. So if you want to see how I made this, you can go check it out. Okay, we're up to 50 now. Okay, a stringless, actually. This is amazing. Okay. Let me go refine that. Maybe I'll refine after I get my first 5 star. Certified whale moment when you insta-skip 4 star pulls. Skipping 4 star is such a whale? Oh no. I swear to god I'm not a whale. <laughs> I am just overly excited for one of these weapons. Okay, we're at 60 now, I think, and here's the soft pity kicking in. Okay, let's see. Two, three, four, five, six, another lion's roar, seven, eight, nine. Where's the five star? What's the five star gonna be? Place your bets now. If it's actually Redhorn, I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna stop. I'm just- if it's Redhorn, I will stop now and move on to rolling for Ito and Kuki. Greaser says Skyward Harp. Failure says Redhorn Trust. I'm hoping it's Redhorn. Skyward Harp also wouldn't be too horrible. I actually regret not pulling on the first Redhorn banner because the second weapon was Skyward Harp and I don't have any 5-star bows and the crit would really have been useful for me. Alright, I guess let's go. Ah, shit. Ah, well. It is what it is. You know what gives good luck? Rudy has redeemed Moo. I'm- am I mooing for good luck? For myself or for you? Anyway, here is your Moo, as promised. I'm trying to learn how to sound more and more like a Minecraft cow. Ningguang gonna be OP. My Ningguang is already OP, thank you very much. Look at her. Look at my gorgeous- look at my gorgeous Ningguang. Look at her. Look at this. Only my queen deserves a triple crown. Thank you so much for following Vibe Checker Shiro. Okay, your business. <laughs> thank you so much for the follow, Shiro. I hope you enjoy watching me spend an- a ridiculous amount of in-game currency for this. Uh, anyway, let's see. Fashion impact, fashion impact. Let's see, let's go back to your original outfit. Switch out for this. That actually looks kind of nice. Granted, it's, it's level one and it's got an attack stat, so I'll have to work on her um, crit rate later on, but otherwise, not too bad. Shiro has redeemed stretch. You can't see me because my model is static, but I am indeed stretching. Thank you for reminding me to stretch. We are one five star in, and Susan has asked me to take a photo of her. Okay, I'll go take a photo of Susan and then and then go back to rolling. Maybe I'll roll at the top of the hill there, even though that's more like a Yoimiya spot because that's where her um, story quest ends. I feel like it would also be a pretty scenic place to do my next couple rolls. Shit, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, 
R5 or Bust Sore? I don't have enough rolls for that, and you know it. R5, R5 never. Or maybe R5 in like five years. Every year I roll for one red horn. Alright. We're at the top of the festival, so... Of the festival area, so let's go for my next five-star weapon. Which one do you think it will be? Do you think it'll be a non-banner weapon? Or do you think it'll be another memory of dust? Or do you think it'll be red horn? SMH not even wailing for Ito? I don't know what you expected out of me. Okay. Official, nice! Okay, I'm really close to C... No, that's actually not true. I was gonna say I'm close to C6 official, but I think I'm actually nowhere near it. SMH not even with Ito. Balls always come in pairs. Felix. So you're saying I'm gonna get two mods, and... It before I get- Oh my god, wait, I hate that. Two- Two balls in one sword. Oh. Felix. Thank you so much for following DragonHex254. I hope you're enjoying the stream. And I hope you're enjoying watching me come to the realization that it is indeed two balls and a stick. <laughs> Good luck, Sword. This is Panda. Oh, hi, Panda. Thank you so much. Rage Red one. This is 20 in. Why did I- why do I keep putting my mouse on the X button every time I'm trying to skip something? This is why I can never see what it is. 30. Or 80? No, 90. Oh god. I get the feeling I'm gonna have to go all the way to soft pity for- for all three fate points. Again, like I did for the- for the engulfing lightning. That's fine, that's average luck. Two balls, one horn. Oh my god, Felix. Are you on 50-50 or 375, 375-25? I'm on 375-375. Sorry, 37.5, 37.5, 25. Fast clicker equals you're an Osu player. I have not played Osu since I was like in primary school. Double sack frags. Never seen before Felix going for the sus. Indeed, never seen before. I think I'll have enough sack frags to like get maybe an R5 copy or two now. Let's go, please. Uh, gravestone mod red horns. My prediction. I've already gotten one mod. Um, that was my first one. My if it's the same as my pulls for engulfing lightning, it'll be the wrong weapon once, an off-banner weapon for the second, and then the right one on the third. That was how it went for my engulfing lightning pulls. Oh my god, Lithic Blade! Let's go! Let's go, let's go. Okay, even though I don't know who's gonna wield it, probably Chung Yun or something. Vibe Tracker Shiro Redeem Moo, what even is this? It's literally a redeem in which I moo for you, like a cow, because that was requested. <laughs> It's a cheap redeem because I am still practicing how to moo. Um, so here you go, Shiro. Here is your moo. 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 I don't sound anything like a cow, and I am sorry about that. It's the best moo? Okay, Rudy. The whole- the redeem exists because of Rudy. <gasps> Wait! Holy shit! Let's go! <gasps> look! Guys, 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 look! Wow, I just cried. Thanks, Shiro. Oh my god, oh my god, guys. Oh my god. It's here. She's here. On Redhorn Banner, of all places to get her. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my god. She really is out here to arrest Ito. That was the best bait. She's here to arrest Ito. <laughs> Finally, Raiden Hyper is a thing. All I need to do is get my is get a Kazuha now. Congratulations, and you suck. Thanks, Rudy. You too. Okay, and I believe 
this is entering self-pity now. Just we're like just below self-pity now. Another stringless, not too bad. I could always do with more stringlesses. Stringless plural. I could always do with more strings. Stringless. You know what? I don't I I guess it's stringlesses. I can't think of what else the plural would be. Stringless high and low. Oh no. Perhaps. Okay, okay. Bets, 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 bets. Your bets. Place them. What is this one gonna be? Someone said Wolf's Greystone. Someone previously said, um, Skyward Harp. Does this be like more strings? Technically, the stringless has strings on it. Skyward Blade. Okay, Skyward Harp. Okay. Red Horn, I will not change. Sucrose, let's go. I don't know what constellation that is, but I don't have C6 yet. Skyward Harp, Skyward Harp banner, please. The first time Red Horn ran, it was with Skyward Harp. And I always regret not rolling on that. Oh my god. Felix, it's actually going to be the two balls in the horn prediction. I hate this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Pulling to soft pity for two of these. Pulling to soft pity for two balls. Uh, okay, at least I know that my next one's gonna be red horn. Oh my god. This has gone perfectly. Ningmei Ning moment? Yes. Isn't that the second worst weapon in the game? I mean, it depends on what you mean by second worst weapon. Like, out of five star weapons? It's probably not ideal, but it's not horrible. I play Ningguang a lot, and it's up there. It's definitely not close. It's definitely not the best, but I'm sure I can make it work. It's going to Ningguang without Bennett, but that never really happens. It happens when Bennett is going to Ito and Ningguang's main DPS on my second team. Yes, I play too many Geo characters, because I really like them all. <laughs> At least it looks nice. Yeah, it's fashion impact, right guys? That's all that really matters in this game. If the if the weapon looks nice in your character, you've done it right. Why is there still an exclamation mark here? Who else? Official. Here we go. Her pilgrimage of bleak. This is the one that heals her. Oh nice. C4 official, let's go. Okay, I'm standing next to the Omamori stand because that's where you make your wishes in real life. And I'm gonna do some wishes in game again. I fully plan on leveling Vortex for Zhongli. It's fashion impact, that's exactly right. The balls love sore, Lenny. Yes, I am sure they do. <laughs> Just like the simulations. Oh no, this is nothing like the simulations. Okay, let's see how many it takes for me to get to Red Horn. That's the real question. If I have to hit Soft Pity again, that'll be three Soft Pities. As always, when it comes to me rolling for weapons. Two lithic blades. Nice, nice. I feel like I've gotten a lot of doubles. I got double sack frags earlier, double lithic blade now. Okay, this is 20. Another lithic blade. I think I have more than R5 now. This is 30. Were these all saved wishes? Yes. I have been saving for a very, very long time. Or actually not that long. I've been saving since 2.4. 2.4? 2 2.5? Raiden and Kokomi was 2.5, right? And that was the last time I rolled. Come on, early pity. I don't think it's gonna happen to me, not on the weapon better. Dragon's Bane. I think this is my first one, or unless I skipped over one, and Toma constellations are always welcome, even though I got Toma on Yaya Miko's banner. The discipline lol. I mean, I'm used to having a lot less currency in a lot of other games where I'm totally free to play and I'm not getting an insane amount, so 
if I know in my mind that I want a character, I will save up until then. There's literally no point in me rolling randomly for something that I don't want and getting it. I caught a wish every time. This is a whale mindset, Quicks. <laughs> this is certified whale mindset. Oh my god. Okay, let's go one more. Let's go. Never mind. We have not yet entered soft cities, so I guess it's not coming anytime soon. Another D bane, perfect. Please, I don't want to have to roll to self pity every time. This makes me so sad. I'm literally rolling to self pity in every single one. Sounds like an awful lot to me. At the very least, maybe it'll bless you with a double five star pull. Oh my god! Imagine that actually happened to me on the first Ito banner, where Ito himself came to me twice in one. It was one was a guarantee, and then plus one one fifty fifty in a single ten. True, probably why I have four C6 five stars sitting on the bench. Oh no. This is a certified whale moment, I'm sorry to say. Oh my god, I'm literally... Okay, in my next 10, I will literally have been 200 wishes down the drain. The pain. Okay, Redhorn is here, at long last. Okay, Dragon's Bane. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't think it's happening, guys. Nine. Nice. And unless the next one is also red horn, I'm it's not gonna be a double. Yeah, no, it's stringless. Okay! Oh my god, I am done. Sora, I'm gonna send you an image in Discord. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay, go ahead. Gonna open it. Spoiler. Oh no. Oh no, you can't be serious. Wait, can I put this image on stream? Save image. Um, downloads. Good old weapon banner. That's like $400 worth of wishes. I feel you. Double Ito then? Just for you? Okay, let's see if I can put images on. Okay, I know that there's a way to add an image. Image file. I just downloaded it. So this is what Green just sent me. I think this is a good representation of my polls today. I'm just gonna put it here above chat. Did you get anything yet? I got these three weapons that Greenster has very nicely given me a graphic for. Pretty much sums it up. The Mao out laughing right now. Oh my god. My god. <laughs> well, at least I have this. At least I have this. And you know what that means? That means I stop now. I'm at, like, one pity into the next weapon. Great, such a, such a boost, am I right? Um, and now I move on to upgrades. Upgrades, everyone. Upgrades. Oh my god, I can do it again. It's on a five minute cooldown. Between you and Rudy, there's gonna be like, you're probably gonna, there's probably gonna be, I don't know how many routines of this this stream. Oh my god, I can do it again. Five checker, uh, Shiro redeemed Moo. Instead of me hey, mooing, would it be sufficient for me to summon Ito? Uh, Ito? Summon Ito? Summon uh, Uji? <laughs> Look at him. Look at the little cow. Murr. Murr. That's, how, that's how he sounds when you summon him. Oh god. Okay. Well, it's an upgrade for sure. I'm seeing we're going from this to this. Um. No, I want full value for my bits. SMH. Okay. I'll personally move for you. Um. Murr. In addition to my mini moves alongside Ushi. Now, what you can't see is I'm going through to an optimizer and checking my artifacts because I'm a nerd and I care about what my stats look like a lot. Where is it? 
19. Um, and this one. Yep. Is this it? It is not. It's this one. Okay, so right now my stats look kind of weird, but I promise by the time my weapon is fully leveled up, it'll look okay. Look at all this fodder! Not even R5 white blind SMH? It's not from your bits, it's your channel points. The stream's done, the stream is not done, because I'm still rolling for Kuki and Goro. The first half of the stream is done. The part where I roll for the weapon is done. It was pretty average. Pretty sad. I don't R5 white blind because Ito doesn't gain anything from um, stacks. Or Ito, sorry, Ito can't do the stacks before beginning his combo, so R5 white blind, refinements on white blind do not matter on him. How many Goro you got? One. I have C0 Goro. The first time I rolled for Ito, I spent 70 pulls and I got one Goro. I got two Itos and one Goro. Just so we're clear. I literally got more Itos than Goros. Tragic C0, that's why I'm rolling now. I cried again. Do you cry because the Moo is good or do you cry because the Moo does not reflect the cows you know and love in real life? I got one Ito and eight Goros. Hey, that's pretty decent. <laughs> I'll be your Gorosaur. I'll be your furry. I don't know if I want that. It reminds me of when people are like, I'll bark for you. Woof woof bark. Maybe I need to have that in addition to a move redeem. Bark redeem. I bark for you. Woof woof bark. Ow. Level 70. We're almost there, guys. I promise you I'm not gonna run out of materials. Right? Right! I'm gonna not have enough, um... I'm not gonna have enough handguards. Oh my god, I need 13 more handguards. Bruh. Bruh. You can't be serious. The move is more than I can ever hope for. I can't wait to pull Cookie tonight. You want it, so you have a problem with people barking for you? I don't have a problem with people barking for me. I just don't know... <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm the only animal that can enter Rudy's room. Oh no. I'm not even allowed to enter, because I am covered in actual animal. That sounds weird, but I have two pet dogs, and Rudy is very allergic. Can I make 13 of these? I can. Do your thing, Sucrose. Okay, nice. 2 out of 13, not bad. Chat paused you to scroll, and I can't see your messages, which makes me sad. Okay. Here we go. And there goes a significant portion of my weapon materials. Nice. Okay, now let's take a look at my stats, because I think they're going to be decent. 94 to 170 is okay, right? I have 157 ER, which I think is sufficient. My def should now be about 2,000... 200? Oh, it's exactly 2,200. Will you ever do a cookie run stream? It depends on if I can figure out what I want to stream for that period- for that long period of time because I will admit the most amount of time that I spend in cookie run is either in arena or managing my resources, neither of which are particularly stream friendly things to do because they don't really give a sense of excitement or entertain, I think. It would have to be more of a chatting stream with cookie run running in the background. I don't know if I could sustain that, but I can try doing that in the future. 
I don't think I'll ever do like a poll stream on Cookie Run because like the gacha process there is a lot less straightforward and getting a cookie is a lot less rare, I guess, unless- and you can't really target ancients or legendaries. I guess I could do one for epics, but that would be like rolling for a five-star epic. That would have to be the whole stream. Alright. Now. Now on to the next part. Now we're rolling for Goro. I don't even remember where the resistance camps are. Oh, they're here. It's literally in Boro Village. All right. It's time to roll for the ever victorious General Goro. Um, I can s I can stand where Tepe died. Rest in peace, my dude. Or I can stand somewhere further up. I think down here is good though, because this is where the resistance is. <laughs> oh, I can't climb that. Alright, so I guess I'm gonna do my go rolls here. I don't know how much I'm willing to spend, because... I've spent a lot of pulls on the Red Horde banner already. That's 200, and... Uh, well, I guess if I roll down to- if I roll down 100, I'll still have enough to guarantee another character in the future. So maybe I'll do that. I'll just see how long- how many I get in the next couple rolls. I am specifically targeting at least one, um, Kuki Shinobu, and I am targeting, um, uh, Goro's C4, if not his C6. I'm also gonna turn dialogue volume down, because I believe- Ito's speech is literally louder than mine. Oh, you're on EU. Lucky. Yeah, um, that's why the banner's already out for me, and not out for most others. Alright, let's go. Alright. Show me what you got, ever-victorious General Goro. Also noted is that I am on guarantee, so if I do end up rolling to a 5 star in this, it will be Ito. I'm only at like 20 pity though. Uh, I rolled up to like a Bennett last time. Sack Great Sword, not very exciting. I think I already have one recently refined. Kuki Shinobu C6 hype? Oh my god, it's not gonna happen. Okay, this one's guaranteed to be a um, banner character. Let's see who it's gonna be. Six, seven, eight, nine. Cookie! Okay, okay, okay. This is going well. This is going well. Okay, I'm gonna put her on my team. It's gonna happen. First temple sets the mood. Oh no. That's horrible. Then I guess I'm only getting sacrificial oh, great swords. Yes, I don't know what to give her. I'll just give her this. I'm gonna level her up. Do I have enough materials to ascend her? That's the real question. One multi and a dream. Yes, one multi will get me three Goros. Yes, definitely. Oh my god, I don't even have enough of this. I don't have enough spectrum materials. Oh my god, I have to farm more of those. Anyway, let's go. Let's keep. Let's keep going. I already clicked on her. What's wrong? Oh, this. Uh, specters, I hate farming specters. We need a bell but for swords. Do we? Oh, because of the HP stat. I guess we do. 
I thought you were gonna say a weapon that's just as useless, but then I realized it wouldn't be useless if it was Kuki. Why no mats? I didn't pre-farm. I swear it's just one t one four star per ten again, and it's not even a character I'm gonna be. Oh please, I have two R five of these already. Oh no, please. Oh no, please. Oh no. SMH my head. Is it really SMH your head? Um, where's my original string list, which is actually leveled up? I'm really, de I'm really considering like refining these two together, even though I know that I probably shouldn't. I told you first temple sets the mood. Oh no, I should have shown you the mats when I saw it. I would prefer not to be spoiled if it wasn't already out on the game. I think, or I. Yeah, I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna elaborate on that further. I mean, I'm not specifically going for Kuki for anything in particular. She is the first Electro Healer, which makes her very valuable. Although I wasn't, like, specifically gonna be gunning for her, I'm specifically gunning for Goro. And also, um, just- to be safe, we don't talk about leaks here. Oh shit, that was the wrong one. The Widsith and the Sack Brags look so similar. Are you doing a copium emote? Probably. But I will probably just use the default copium if I am gonna have one. Because I feel like that's more recognizable. Where's my dragon's bane? Oh my god, I only got four extra. Yes, ma'am, I'll plug all of them leaks. Thanks, Pex. Um, what else was there? Oh, Lithic. I have exactly enough for 1R5. That's actually pretty sweet. So, unlock, 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 unlock. How do you get the default one? Um, I would use BTTV or... Um, Frank of C or 7TV or something like that, which has where in which someone has uploaded the emote, and then I'll just add it to my channel. There we go. One R5 copy of Lithic Blade. And my only Lithic weapon, by the way. I like how I have exactly one leftover R1 Dragon's Fame and Stringless. They're just kind of sitting there. Meanwhile, uh, my lion's roars. I have so many extra now. It's kind of weird. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them all. Bennett main DPS, Kaching main DPS, Kuki Shinobu main DPS all at once. That's the only solution. No, no, like, what's the name? It would be just Copium. I don't have it added to my stream. Um, BTTV Copium. You can try seeing if it's added to my channel now. Does this work? I don't think it's showing up. If it does, it'll show up on my stream. No, it's not showing up. It'll be like that if I do add it. It's a BT it'll be a BTTV emote, but I don't have it added just yet. Or I just added it, but it'll take a while to update. Can you put Festering Desire on Shinobu? I want to see how it looks. Okay. Failure redeemed Moo. Okay, Failure, this is for you. Uh. Mm, mm. 
Looks dope. It does. The thing is, the pink on that is just a slight- it's just a, sl a tad too red for her color palette. I think. But it otherwise looks nice. <laughs> big, big booty. She got a big booty. Oh no. Does she though? Okay. Well, that's 30 rolls, and I've gotten two weapons, which I already have refined, and one cookie. The one cookie is at least a success. Copium. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Chongyun? Okay. Please give me a Goro. Please, Agoro. Oh no. Oh no. This is gonna be Sara all over again. I'm not gonna get any cons. Oh, this hurts. Please, Goro, I'm in the resistance camp. You know what? I need to change my team. Here we go. And maybe I'll I'll put you here. I'll put you in front of the house. Oh my god, I can already feel I can already feel that I'm not gonna end up with any girls. There we go. Complaining worked, I guess. Complaining worked. This is C1. I want at least C4, if not C6, but I don't know if that's gonna happen or not. Oh my god, I'm literally getting one four star per pull. I'm like halfway rolled down now from 280 something. Is that greatsword? My Paimon.moe upload is going to have a field day with this- with today's rolls. Another one! Let's go! C2! People always say C4 healing sucks, but honestly it's good enough to deal with corrosion IMO. Um, I mean, the sustain is nice. I do run in with Zhongli anyway, so it's not like my team is taking too much damage from other sources. So if it's just enough to deal with corrosion, that's really all I need to deal with. Alright, let's take a look at you, long, young lad. The CD of Goro's uh, skill is decreased by 2 seconds. That's actually pretty useful because his skill cooldown is ridiculously long. Extended by 1 second when you get a crystallized reaction. Okay, that's also good. Always good to have a longer lasting ult. Make the buff last for longer. Right now it's pretty short. Alright. Putting Kokomi on the team worked. Okay. I think I'm pretty close to um, actual pity now, so if I get an Ito in the next few rolls, don't be surprised. And just as I say that, he turns up. Nice. Three, four. There he is. There's my boy. He's back. Arataki Ito. Which 4 star am I gonna get this pull, this roll? Another cookie! Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Look at the two of them. The Arataki gang, reunited. Not bad. So this will be his C3, which increases his burst talent. I believe, is it his burst talent actually? No, uh, it's his- wait, it's his C2. Why did I think it was his C3? His C2, which is each party member whose element is Geo will decrease that skill's CD by 1.5 seconds and restore 6 energy to Ito, which is useful because I- um, it's up to 4.5 seconds, including himself, so Goro and Zhongli, which is the, usually combo, the usual combo I run him with, should be sufficient to trigger the full passive. You know, boy, 
Was it really a moan? I mean, I am excited to see him, so this is great. This is literally my highest investment, or my most, my highest investment five star that I have like deliberately gone for maybe, on par with um, Raiden Shogun actually now, because both of them are C2 with signature weapon R1. Combo Nerd redeemed, redeemed Hydrate, hello Combo, and welcome to my stream, and thank you for reminding me to hydrate, I have not had any water today. Thank you so much for the support, Combo. I hope you're having a good day. Five Checker Shiro said C60 to wear and also redeemed Moo. So here's your Moo. And then Vex has redeemed Klee voice, which means that for the next minute, I'll speak in Klee voice. It's Spark Knight Klee of the Knights of Avonius reporting for duty. So I hope this is being picked up in my mic because I'm talking in a really high voice. I'm gonna spend another 30 rolls or so on the Arataki Ito banner, and I hope I see more of Big Brother General Garo. Five Checker Shiro says, oh no. What's wrong, Shiro? Come on, it's as clear voice to Krieg as him. Thanks so much, Combo. so much, Felix. Everyone stay calm, it's happening. Oopsie to Cookie Shinobu. Look at big sister Cookie and big brother Chongyun. Okay, that's the one minute up. Thanks for the redeem, Vex. Klee is gonna bring home the goods. I can also, I can also just do the Klee voice for fun, I guess. I actually, I, it's actually surprising for me how easily I can do her voice without straining myself. I mean, it depends. If I feel like it's appropriate, I might just use her voice randomly. The true path, which increases his skill, I think, by three? Yeah, that's this one. And Kukishinobu's C2, I believe, was pretty useful for her kit. The- oh, no, it's not what I thought it was. It increases her... skill duration by three seconds? Grass Rego San- Yeah, okay, it increases her skill duration by 2 seconds. This one increases the AoE by 50% of her burst. Reminded me of Noelle voice in EN. I've tried to do a Noelle impression before, actually, and I tried to do, like, a... The... Yes, you are my little pog champ. Come here, voice, uh, for... But using Noelle's voice. I feel like her... Vocal range is definitely within my capabilities. I just haven't really been able to successfully pull it off in a way that really sounds like her yet. That's one roll, is it? I mean, I guess one minute is one roll, give or take. Okay, let's see what I get. Is Pop School Boy discount Shinha? No, they are not remotely the same. They are not remotely similar. In terms of kit. In terms of, um, lore, they're similar, I guess. They're both exorcists, or... They are of related exorcist lines, I guess. Not another sack bow. Is sack bow on, like, secret raid up or something? It's not like I need one for my Goro. I have a fav bow. Spare for him. I swear it's like a secret raid up. Look at this. Shinha also buffs cryo allies and physical and reduces physical and cryo resistance of enemies, but Chongyun doesn't do any such thing. Um, where's my sack? It's already R5. So I have these two down here, I guess. And all these lions were lying around. Lying around. Can I have it for Gelan? What do you mean? Chongyun cannot doesn't- Chongyun's main, uh, defining feature of his kit is that 
his elemental skill while you're standing inside the circle it creates infuses all your attacks with cryo but this only applies to um the physical damage done by sword pole arm and claymore users so he doesn't affect the alana in any way besides reducing her skill cooldown if you have his constellations so essentially him and yelan have no effect together oh your sack bow yeah sure i mean i wish i could donate you my extra sack bows because i have this r5 one I have this R5 one, and then I have this R2 one. I would donate it in a heartbeat. It's like me asking people for sex swords because this is my only one and it's R2. Okay, I'm gonna do at least one more temple and see how far I get with Goro's cons. I know I said I wanted to roll down, uh, roll at least get C4, but I don't know when that, if that's gonna happen. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. Okay. It's guaranteed to be a banner 4 star, it's just which one of them is it? That's what makes the whole difference for me right now. And it's Choyun, who is now C6. Oh boy. Where are you? I mean, C6 Chunyun is cool. Haha, <laughs> very cool because he's a cryo unit. Haha. <laughs> uh, but it's not as cool as C6 Goro. Man, this is so tempting. Do I just keep going? My 4 star luck is horrible, always. Hmm. Oh my god. Flip a coin? Should I? Or should I put a pole? Um. I'm gonna make a pole. Okay, here's a poll. So do I keep rolling for Goro Constellations? Okay, right now, I have 100% votes for yes, keep going. That's three people voted. Five people voted yes. At this point, I don't think anyone's gonna vote no. It looks like yes won the vote, overwhelming five versus zero. So I guess I guess we keep going then. The real question is how much further do you go? It's all about rolling why even make a poll. If you get C4 Goro, I'll give you five hundred bits. Okay, bet, Panda. Freaking bet. In before I roll all the way down to zero to zero and I literally don't even get him. I don't think it's gonna happen, but knowing my four star luck, it's entirely possible. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna hide this now. Bet. <laughs> it really is bet. Okay, another four star. Also, in case I roll up to another five star, do you guys want to bet on who it's gonna be? Only do singles for the bets rates. I don't think that's how it works. I am, yeah, I also will say, if you sub, you can be a founder at this point, because, yeah. Okay! 
C3, let's go. Okay. C3, Prage, Jean. Okay. I would actually be really happy if really happy if I got Jean. I don't think it'll happen, but I would be really happy if I got Jean. One more. If you lose 50-50, it will be Diluc. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, so I don't have Jean and I don't have Mona out of the um standard out of the standard five. Um Meanwhile, this guy just stalks me constantly. You get a four star every ten, so if you get midway, then reset the ten, right? That's not how it works, because even even if you get one midway, it counts those extra rolls towards your next ten, by the way. Mona, okay. Bet. If it was if it was Mona, I would also be really happy. Bet. It could also be Ito. <laughs> or it could also be Kaching or Chi Chi, just saying, but I would be a little bit less excited about them. For Diluc, it's like a double-edged sword. On one hand, I'm excited to get a C6 5-star, because I can kind of flex it. On the other hand, it's Diluc. And the fact that I have him C6 would be, like, evidence <laughs> that this character hates me. <laughs> I'm not gonna bet I already jinxed the last one. Oh, thanks, Felix. All right, let's go. Another one. I have dipped below the threshold for a guarantee for a noble five-star unit, but it's fine. I'll probably recuperate it by the end of the patch, or by the time uh, the next five-star I want rolls around, I guess. Depending on how many I have to roll down. Oh no. Oh no, C7. C7, Chongyun. He is here. Oh no. Okay, dude. Oh, I also forgot. I technically do have a lot of star... glitter. So if I wanted to, you know... I could always, uh... do a little trade? Why did I open that? I don't want to co-op with people right now, that's not what life is about. Madame likes Dilute. That's that's a better name for him than Diluc. He is Dilute. Just like his personality. So much Star Glitter. I never spend it on anything except for Constellations and um, the one time I bought Black uh, the Black Cliff Polearm. Those are the only things I ever spend it on. And given how much I roll nowadays, I'm getting the consolations from wishes instead, so... I swear Sackbo is like on a secret radar. What is this? Gambling addiction with them glitters? It's literally another more than half, more than two thirds of a pity. Sackbo is legit on secret radar, I swear. This is the third one I've gotten on this character banner. I get like, Goro can use it. But it's not- it's really not the best choice. Unless it's trying to tell me when the bow is there, a girl will follow, in which case, thanks game, I guess. Okay, I think I'm pretty close to another pity. I wasn't keeping track, because I got too distracted by the fact that I got so many sack boobs. But I think I'm pretty close to pity again. Like, pity for a 5 star. 4, 5, 6, seven. Oh no. Chongyun is the new Bennett. Oh no. Those who know, they know. If you know, you know. This better not be like my Raiden stream where I literally got C19 Bennett out of it. More star glitter for the collection? That's true, Copium. Every time I get a five, a four star above, um, 
above C6, it gives me enough for another roll. Copium. Ahem. <coughs> copium. I'm choking on all the copium. Does the copium emote work now? Fuck, I didn't caps off it. No, it's not working. Why is that? We're gonna refresh the chat box, guys, for a moment. Alright, let me try sending copium now. There we go. There's the copium emote. If you refresh the Twitch page, then that means it should be working now. Oh my god. Copium. I'm choking on all the copium. I've got a cup of coffee next to me, I gotta drink it to get the taste of copium out of my mouth. Alright, let's go boys. Another 10. I'm like a drug addict. Addicted to copium. And it's another 5 star. Place your bets, guys. Or you already placed your bets. Let's see which one of you got right. Okay, C4! C4 Goro! C4 Goro is here. That's what I'm talking about. GG. Thanks so much, Panda. Thank you so much for your generous donation of 500 bits. Seriously, thank you. Oh well. I guess it's fine. Copium. Oh. C1GG. You got my GG luck, lol. At least it's not Diluc. At least it's not Diluc. Copium. Lapping Hound Warm as Water? That's such a cute name! Better than Diluc, am I right? Yeah, she's actually better than Diluc in every way. That's Jean when she was a baby. She'll grow into a Jean. Oh boy. More like... I think... I don't know. Okay. What does this one even do? It's the energy regen one. Um... Okay. So, maybe I'll stop there? I mean, I was hoping for Goro C6, but I think it's very unlikely I'll get the last two constellations in any reasonable number of rolls. C6 Chi Chi for that revive hype? I... No, I don't think so. Knowing my luck, next time I roll, I'm gonna get C6 Goro, like how I got C6 Sara today. I'm actually really excited for this, because I've... Those of you who watched my last full stream know that I spent several additional rolls past getting C2 Raiden to try and get extra copies of Sara, including me going for Kokomi after losing a 50-50, um, and also doing some extra rolls after that. And getting in another Chi Chi after that. All just for a C5 and extra Bennett's. But getting this has been a great surprise. Off of the weapon banner, no less, instead of the character banner. Let me take a look at the kooky ones I got. I already took a look at these two. I didn't get any further ones. The next one would have increased her skill talent a bit off if it was activated. Um. I guess I'm gonna wait to see for further analysis to see if Kuki is worth taking to extra constellations because I would love to use her. She's the first vector healer in the game and no um, prototype Amber Lisa does not count so I'm looking forward to trying her out. As for Goro, I mean I'm sad I didn't get a C6. Um, the C6 would have been a huge buff to my team in the way that C6 Sara is a huge buff to my um, Raiden team but realistically I don't know if I'll be able to get him. Yeah, look at that. 
increases the crit damage of all nearby uh, members' geo damage. It's like Sara's buff. Sara's is even higher though, if I'm not mistaken. Sara's is 60%. Boros is 40. So anyway, maybe I'll go test them out. Now weekly bosses. I already did my boss my weekly bosses this week. Who's a good test subject? I need something that kind of stays in place and doesn't move around a lot. Maybe Magu Kenki? Question mark? What do we have here? Nope, not these. Also, why do I bull eyed? not have a death hat in this set? I guess not. His crit rate is really low for Pavonius. Did you do Abyss? Yes, I have 36 start Abyss for this cycle as well. It came out about a week ago, so I did it back when it came out. Um... I also kind of want to test Kuki, but I'm not really sure what to put on her. Maybe I'll just give her Kokomi's artifacts for a bit and see how that goes. I don't think it'll take her very far. Level 1 talents at all. Where is Kokomi's feather? Don't tell me it's this. Oh my god, are you serious? That might be Kokomi's feather. Do I not have a single HP percent one? How can my luck on a set be this bad? Oh, it's... No? What's Kokomi's feather? Oh! It's okay. Okay. We don't have an HP percent sword, do we? Festering on... Maybe this, actually. I can't level up any of that. Maybe I'll test it on the Ruined Serpent, because I need to farm that for Kuki anyway. Oh shoot, I can also put her in my um, teapot now. Now that I finally have someone who is not maxed out on friendship. Um, who is here? <laughs> Also put the Luminous Spark gadget on because I think I'll need that. Oh shoot, I have it. I have not charged it up at all. Uh, there's some stones up there that I could use to charge it. I think I saw them just now. They were glowing. Ah, oh, there they are. Please don't blow me up. Please don't blow me up. They will blow me up. Charge it when the boss starts, he automatically reduces you to two charges. Oh, 
Okay, well, anyway. And I know that he also uh, grants like a crystal, which gives charge to. Oh no, I have no energy. Why didn't he give me any energy just now? Does this boss not generate any? Where are you? Yep, okay, there's some energy. Oh my god, I'm gonna spend more of this fight regenerating energy than anything else. Okay, there we go. energy back now though and this thing barely generates any Curious, peculiar. There's probably better targets to test on than the Ruined Serpent who's moving around so much. Righteous Vines? Regular enemies? Abyss Kenki still strikes me as the best one. Never used Kuki? I don't know. I feel like she would- if she got hit, she would just die. Granted, she has Jolie's shield on her, but also her healing is insignificant, and also, um, she takes off her own HP every time she heals. Masanori. Oh, shoot! I forgot that guy existed. Find me the guy. He's like around here somewhere. Is he down here? You know what? Why don't I just Google his location? Oh, I just have to keep going. There he is. I can even see his little dirt patch on the map where he stands. Can I restore myself energy when I'm not in combat? I cannot. Okay, I'm just gonna save my burst for next round. Can I escape this? Yeah, I'm gonna teleport away and come back. So that I can actually do the fight with my, um... 
bursts up, except for Goro's. Goro can just have skill, the arena is really small. And the buff is essentially the same. Oh shit, can I only challenge him once per day? Man is legit smooth as butter with these with the with this team setup. Damage wise I realize I have the wrong goblet. Damage wise I realize I have the wrong goblet on. Can't wait. My ER here is lower though, so maybe that's maybe it was a better idea to keep that one. No, just ult him again, that's just a style up when you leave rules. Okay. Also, this is his that was his midnight battle, which is why he was a little bit stronger, I believe. Um I believe if I talk to him now, he'll be slightly weaker. I need to go recharge my burst somewhere else though. Let's see, is there anything around here that I can use? Oh, there's only Kabuto in there. Not that I need any more of them. I already leveled up Ito as high as he can go. Also, your ER was fine, especially with C2. Uh, yeah, I'm currently running on just below 160 ER. Um, if I swapped goblets to one with higher crit, it would be 140 ER, and I'm not sure if that is sufficient, especially because I feel like Jolie barely generates any particles. Are there not enemies here? Ah oh, shit, I see a time trial down there I should have done. Yeah, I was gonna say, I was surprised to see that his burst was immediately back up at the end of the last rotation that I had. I'm guessing this is a C2 thing? Yeah, it's, it's insane what a difference that makes. Smooth as butter, honestly, playing him in a comp like this. All I need is Albedo now. I'm sure Ningguang could do the trick too, or GOMC, but I really do want Albedo. I actually run full Geo and the recommended ER for Caesar was like 125%. That's with 4 Geo though, right? And I'm assuming you're running a character who has high energy gen. down the hill. Oh no, my artifact inventory is full. Um. Oh no, this is so cool. Okay, maybe I'll hold this. Yeah. I'm using Albedo. I guess Albedo is this kind of RNG-ish. No, it's gone. It's fine, it's like a one star, I guess. Anyway, I see an enemy over there so that I can charge my burst off. 
It's an Anemo Vanguard. Let's go here. Imagine having full artifacts. I know, I used to like consistently sit at like around 700, then suddenly, recently, after I was farming for Ito, I hit 1,500 pretty often. Time to fight Mr. Masanoi again. we go boys nice and i got the achievement the achievement for fighting masanori in under, in under 30 seconds he is a lot more tanky when he when it's past midnight i will say oh was a mono The T as I have it now is probably just fine. I'm probably not gonna go for a C6 Goro. If I do decide on it at a later date, I might roll for him off stream, but I don't think four star pulls, especially at this point, are necessarily too exciting to watch. So I will if I pop up in a future stream with a C6 Goro, it's probably because I rolled more on this banner off stream. Thank you all for being here and watching the stream. Thank you for watching me suffer in hitting soft pity every single time for red horn plus two balls and thank you green for the fantastic graphic i really appreciate this masa who exactly decimated thank you so much for watching thank you so much for the support thank you panda for the donation seriously it means a lot to me and um uh, I hope it was entertaining. I hope you enjoyed watching the stream. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. Oh no, Ben. Yes, you did come at the end. This always happens inevitably with someone. Someone always arrives at when the stream is like... When I'm literally doing the stream ending. I'm so sorry. But this is the results of my stream. Two memory of dust. One red horn stone thresher, um, one Chi Chi constellation, one Chi Chi constellation, um, a Kuki and two constellations, Goro and four constellations, and a bunch of extra Chunyuns. Oh, plus one extra Ito constellation. I hope you had fun. Yes, I did have fun. I mean, as fun as rolling away all of your savings can feel. Uh, all of your Prima Gem savings can feel, but yes, thank you so much. So, I hope to see you around. Unfortunate that you couldn't make it to the stream, but thank you for being here, even if right at the end. Alright, I'll see you around. Bye-bye!